This is the new America. Black, brown, gay, Muslim, you name it. We're a growing share of the population, but politically unpredictable. Together, we'll look at what these numbers could mean in this election year if we stand up to be counted. America by the numbers. Welcome to Clarkston, Georgia. By the numbers, it's one of the most diverse cities in the U.S. Emmanuel Ransom moved to Clarkston in 1963, the year Martin Luther King marched on Washington. When I first came to Clarkston, the Ku Klux Klan used to march in front of my house right down here off of Ponce Leon. When I was a kid, my daddy used to take me out to Stone Mountain and we watched the Ku Klux Klan, and they would take an old car up on top of the mountain, set it on fire, and push it off the front of the mountain, and everybody would scream and holler. You talking about exciting. When you first got here, was the city council all white men? Yes. Was the mayor a white man? Yes. And did you feel like you were excluded? Yes. In Clarkston, whites became the minority by 1990. And now, it's home to refugees from all over the world. What is this here? This is a knife. When the bullet finished, there's a lot of the kids. These were your children? Yeah. She's got a bullet in her hips. And I have a bullet and another knife here. Another knife wound here, too. Mm. Since the early 80s, thousands of refugees from Vietnam and Bhutan and some 40 other countries have come to this area to escape war, starvation, and massacre. When you come here, you already have hope. They dump them in these apartments sometime and don't tell them how to light the stove. They build a fire in the middle of the floor and burn the apartments. We work hard. We're buying for close homes. They need to be taught the American way so that they don't goof up. Clarkston is full of refugees clamoring for U.S. citizenship and the right to vote. Can you tell me what is the capital of the United States? No one here has ever voted, and many were stripped of citizenship in their homeland. People in America think democracy is given to them. Oh, I don't need to vote. I, you know, something like that. But for us, it's so important because we are doing it for the first time, you know. What was your first reaction when you saw that Clarkston was changing? Oh, thank goodness. When I bought the store, this was a pretty low-income neighborhood. It was a rough environment, and it has changed dramatically since the immigrants have come in. Should white America be afraid of becoming a minority. They should only be afraid of becoming a minority if it's within the old definition of what a minority means, marginalized, left out, disenfranchised. The new mainstream is inclusive. Everybody is welcome to the new mainstream. 